everybody, this is Auntie Pasta, and welcome to my Let's Play. Um, today is the 17th part of The Runaway Teen, and um, tomorrow, when the sun comes up for Ruthie, Abel's, and Michael, um, it will be Ruthie's birthday. So they have something special planned. Um, they are running away some more, but first they are going to get their friends together and go camping. So let's see if I could even do this. I was thinking I might not be able to bring a bunch of teens somewhere. Um, let's have her, oh wait, she can't because he's going to be putting this away. We are going to quickly just put some things in our inventory. Let's let her wake up. And then, um, he is going to take a vacation, and let's see, he only knows Cassie, let's see, I want to have her do it then, take a vacation, and let's bring all of the group hidden, let's see if we could do this, I hope we can, I hope they come. Oh, she's so tired. It's night time. I decided to leave at night because that way the kids won't be in school or anything. I could take a vacation day now. So he is... Okay, is this going to work? All right. We'll be back when we get there. So we are here with our club, and it looks like everything went well. When they were renting the cabin, they were able to fake it and um, make it so uh, so they could um, rent this out. They were able to fake it and trick the people into they didn't know that, um, that there's actually there's actually teenagers going to do this. I'm just putting some extra beds out here for. Whoever wants them, and a little light here, and oh, we have food. Um, so I think I will assign this to Michael and Ruthie, and they are hungry and tired. The reason I'm getting a cabin is because that way they can, uh-oh, there's no... Oh, there isn't a stove here, and I can't change it. I was going to have someone make a cake for her, but it's not going to work. <laughs> okay. I'm going to just cut out for a second. Okay, here we are, and I was able to slip a oven in here, but it looks like it already took it away so it won't let me have an oven in here well that's a bummer um unless I totally did a different I have no idea what's going on okay so we might not be able to have a birthday party for Ruthie but they could still have a little fun and she's going to eat this granola and Michael's uh needs a shower um there's an outdoor shower here. Let's have them take a shower. And then everybody else can do their own thing. We have um, Sonia here, and Wolfgang is here, and Cassie has to pee, it looks like. And somebody just went in there. Don't go in the tent and sleep. I want you to eat the granola. Can you eat granola, please? So everybody's here, and they're going to walk in on each other. She just walked in on Sonia. Even though Sonia's not even in there, she did a shocked thing. Did you see that? Wolfgang is like, so this is where you're going to sleep with him. I think Wolfgang is a kind of sad that he didn't hit it off with Ruthie as much. You know, he liked her. They had some flirting now he's alone in the bathroom with Cassie, so. Well, they're going to all hang out in the bathroom. How about you sit 
in this chair over here, okay? And he's done. And, oh, these two are flirting, I think. So let's have him come watch TV. Why not? So when there's a TV available, why not? Oh, look, here's the... Here's Luke Bar Barber. I think maybe Michael should handle this and ask him to leave very politely and say, hey, my dad's sleeping, so hopefully this guy won't get suspicious. Oh, he's flirting with... Okay, can we ask him to leave? Let's have her watch some TV and maybe she could watch some cooking. Don't be rude, Michael. Just tell him to leave. <laughs> She's not going to watch. She doesn't want to watch TV, I guess. Let's play cards with Cassie and Wolfgang. Let's let Michael do his own thing. Meaning that I'm going to take Michael around to harvest some things and look for some things. It's dark, though. Maybe I should just have him go to sleep. Oh, I should show you, um... Oh, there's a fire pit back here. Um... In between, uh... Let me start over. Three, two, one. A lot of people are walking through their camps. I don't like it. A lot of adults are walking through here. It's kind of tricky, you know. Okay, so the day before on Thursday, um, Michael and Ruthie went around and they collected some things. And they were able to collect a bunch of stuff and go fishing. Um, so I'm just going to sell a bunch of stuff, including this eggplant whirl frog. And yeah, let's go ahead and breed these so you have a little bit more money. I think the onions are going to stay in his inventory and all the food. Um, let's see what Ruthie has. I can't remember. She did get that fishing. And um, I was looking for blackberries. And I think this sage is... Oh, yep, that's her, her sage. I don't want to sell that yet because they're going to be moving soon. They have 3,898 simoleons, so that's pretty good. So these guys are playing. I'm going to have I'm going to have him join the game because I want them all to become friends. And I wonder if Wolfgang will cheat because I think he's... I think he might just be a crabby guy. I don't think he's a bad guy. Oh, well, he's mean and he's gloomy. So, yeah, he's not really... Ruthie's type. <laughs> but I think Cassie is gloomy too. I think she is. She's gloomy. So maybe Wolfgang and Cassie would be good for each other. Maybe she could get him out of his meanness. She's creative. Okay, he must be tired. He just keeps taking off. Um, let's have him sleep. He's going to go sleep in that bed. And... I think Ruthie is tired too, and I do want them to get up in the morning and go somewhere. Because it will be Ruthie's birthday. And they want to throw her a little party. I don't know if we could do an official party, but maybe we could really make a cake. I'm not sure. Oh, Wolfgang. Quit following her around like a puppy. Nope. Turn it off. There we go. Yeah, let's not wake up these guys. This, there isn't a wall here. There's only this partition in this cabin. It's not for a bunch of sims. I think he's going to go sleep here. Oh, he followed Cassie. He was going to sleep in the... I don't know where Sonia is. Cassie's going to sleep in the tent. Don't you dare turn that TV on, Wolfgang. I will turn it right back off.
No, you're not gonna watch it, dude. See? He woke him up, I think. Uh, ask him. Let's do a friendly... I don't think they really even know each other. It's like, dude, why are you turning on the TV? You see Cassie... Not Cassie. Ruthie and I are here. Are sleeping? Go sleep in the tent. Maybe... Suggest some fun activities. Get to know. Let's see. He wants to chat with someone. He is chatting with... Oh, is he a... Brag about your possessions. Why not? Complain about your parents. Okay, so he wants to watch TV, but... Oh, he wants to buy a TV. We can't do that yet. He wants to lock a door. Buy an object worth $1,000. Buy a chess table. Well, he wants to buy everything. Let's have him light this. Maybe if he lights this, Wolfgang will come out here instead of... I wish I could delete this. I can't delete it, though. Come on out here, Wolfgang. Don't turn that on. Why don't you come hang out by the fire? Yeah, invite Wolfgang. I think Sonia went home. Maybe she's hiking, I don't know. Okay. So, Michael's here getting to know Wolfgang a little bit better. Discuss interests, um, deep conversation. Michael's a nice guy, so he's just, you know, going to get to know Wolfgang, even though Wolfgang is kind of a grumpy guy. That's okay, though. Um, I would like Ruthie to get some really nice sleep, so... What is on? Because that's not on. It says it's off. Turn off this light. Okay. Let's turn off this whole room. There we go. Now she, her sleep should go faster. He's tired too. But it's good to keep Wolfgang out of there because he's totally turning on the TV and everything. Okay, it's morning, it's six in the morning, and um, Michael did his best to keep Wolfgang off the TV so Ruthie could sleep. Um, it looks like Wolfgang is making something. I'm not sure, they look like burgers. Um, let's see what he brings inside. And we'll have Ruthie get up and eat some. Yeah, they're hamburgers, why not? Just go ahead and grab a serving. It is her birthday now. I don't know if you can have a birthday. See, it's not all sparkly. So I think that you cannot have a birthday when you're vacationing. You can't have a birthday party or age up. I think we're going to have to go back to their lot. But there are a few things that I want to look for first before we go back to her lot. So let's just get them fed and then we'll change them into their outfits and um, <laughs> poor Michael didn't get any sleep and I'm going to run him around now. Um, Have you, I'm going to have you nap for a little bit, Michael. Go ahead. You don't need to eat that. Ruthie does. She needs that, and she needs to use the restroom real quick. And then I'm going to get her running around. I'm not going to record that part. I just want them to run around and collect some things so they have more money and also some herbs and uh, berries, maybe, if I could find the berries. Um, 
just have some items. So I'm going to cut out here and I'll be right back. Okay, we're just gonna follow Ruthie around because I think it's, this place is so gorgeous. I really love this place and um, I'm gonna give the opportunity to just kind of look around a little bit. I've already queued her up to um, collect a few things so I thought we would just enjoy the woods with her a little bit because this is such a beautiful place. I mean, I love it. Um, I love the woods in real life and I'd like to get some more camping in this this summer. Oh, is that something? Nope. And um, she collected a frog. What kind of frog? A tiger frog. Can we breed it? Let's see what happens when we breed it with a dirt whirl frog. Will it give us something new? Yes. Oh, a striped dirt frog. It's only $30, so I'm going to go ahead because these are 120 There is a 165 one. I can't remember the name of it, but you have to breed them with other ones. Um, so I'm giving Michael a chance to take a nap also. He's over here napping. Let's let him breed his frogs. And I believe they're going to, we might lose our other people because they might go to school, our other um, campers. How do you, oh wait, that's hit hers. <laughs> so he has this and um, She's just collecting some wild herbs and what I think there is some wild uh, I think that's chamomile. We're not gonna lose that because oh there's a bear. Um let's see. So she's pretty happy. She wants to tell a joke to somebody and flirt with Michael. So I think that is something she could do and um Michael's pretty hungry, I think. No, he's not at all. Oh, there's a nice one. Let's, um... Michael's gonna wake up, and I think she's done. Let's have her be done. Pretty soon. After she picks this other one, we won't let her do this one. And we're going to go to another lot to see if... Oh, there's a rock. Maybe we could come back here. Let's have Michael come here. Maybe it'll take too long. There it is. That's a berry, I believe. A noxious berry. Um, and dig there. She's not having fun. So Michael is going to say, hey, let's go. Let's travel together. Yeah, I, th I knew it. Their, their, their party is gone. So it's just the two of them now. It's early morning at the lodge and uh, Ruthie and Michael came over here. Let's have her give him. Oops. Let's have her. Oh, let's have them become best friends forever. They're doing this fun, adventurous thing together. And um, let's enthuse about the outdoors. And I thought they already became. Oh wait, she's not friends with Cassie now. Best friends. Okay, let's have her flirt a little bit, but I don't want to go overboard because if we only had some bug sprayers, not bug spray, bug cream. Okay, so I wanted to see if this worked. I Where's the lodge? Well, or not really a lodge, but it's a nature center, I guess. I put a oven here. Yes, it worked! Okay, can we? We can't. We can't. There's no fridge available. I forgot to put a refrigerator. Can I edit it now? I can! Yay! Okay. Um, 
I'm going to move you over, and I hope this works, because I really, 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 really want to have a cake. Oh, there's other objects in the way. Here, let's take you. This is very cute, though. I don't want to lose it. I, I like this thing. Create some ambiance. Okay. Um... <laughs> Let's go ahead and put one of these here. Cause there we go. I just want to fill in that gap. Okay, can she bake a cake? Can she? Let's do a white cake. Um, let's see if this works. I really hope it does. And Michael, while she is doing that, I am going to... Why don't you harvest that wild plant and um, just going to queue him up for a few things. So I don't know if this will work or not to, <laughs> I really hope it does. This is something that they've been planning for a long time to have a birthday party for Ruthie with all of her friends to come out camping, but I guess it's not going to happen. She's not going to be able to have a birthday party, but at least she'll have to, she'll have a birthday cake if this all works out. I have a feeling it's not going to let us age her up, but we could always try. Where are you going with that, honey? Honey bunny. Okay, so let's have him go here, and I want you to sit down for a minute, and... Can I do anything? Oh, yes. Let's add, there's lots of, let's add a birthday thing. And we're going to just have a little private birthday for Ruthie here. And, um, where's Michael? Is he on his way? Come on. Okay, so let's have her, can I? have her blow out the candles? Is this how it works? Will she age up now? Yes! Wow! Okay, so she's self-assured, she loves the outdoors, and she can we have her be good? Let's have her be a bookworm. I think that will go with her trait to um, become a best-selling author. And um, she hasn't changed very much. We'll have a... Now, what happened... I don't understand with the clubs because I did change the club... So young, you have to be teen or a child or young adult and a teen. Let's add Ruthie. I guess Michael will be the head of this now. Um, Uh-oh, Michael has an itch. Okay. Oh, he's so cute. So that wasn't very, oh my gosh, this did not turn out at all like I was hoping. Um, so Ruthie had a little birthday, and um, now let's have her, um, let's have her add some, maybe she should have a birthday party for Michael. I know that it's not his birthday in a long time, but I want to age him up. Um, because I want them to be the same age. So, let's have him come over here and blow out the candles. And you stand here. Oh, she's celebrating still. Oh, good, she's celebrating him. 
Yay! It's a little private birthday for the both of them. Yay! Now they're both young adults. Okay, so he is materialistic. He is romantic. And let's see, what else do we want him to be? Active? Kleptomaniac? No, he's going to be a good guy. He's not going to. Um, good? Art lover? Maybe we can have him create art and sell money? Outgoing? Now that they're young adults, they can talk to whoever they want. Um, he could be ambitious. Because, um, he has a materialistic trait. But he wants to do things on his own. He doesn't want it just handed to him from his father. Um, let's have him be creative, a slob, an insider, insane. Uh, let's see. Maybe I should make him a geek so he can work on computers and stuff. I think I'm just going to stick with good. I think that's... He's happy around other sims with positive moodlets. He could donate to charity. He becomes sad when interacting with evil sims. I think that will work really well for the story um, that he just can't he can't do what his dad wants him to do. His dad wants him to be a criminal. So, um, why are you celebrating? She's not okay. So she's reading a book, and he's itching like crazy. I think I'm going to send them home. This is so sad. I'm so sorry that this turned out to be not a very good um, episode. A birthday, not a great birthday episode, but I did want to get them out into the woods and enjoying things and collecting things. Um, I might collect a few more things off screen and then bring them back home so next time you see them they will have their makeovers because they are older, They're, they get a new look. He is just so handsome. I just love the sim. Oh, he is just so handsome. Anyway, thank you. Gixer girl for making him for me for Ruthie. I think they are going to be doing wonderful together. Look at those green eyes. Okay, I'm gonna move on and I hope you enjoyed this episode. Next episode should be a lot more um, entertaining, <laughs> I hope. Um, Okay, well, if you like this episode, by chance you happen to like this episode, please give me a thumbs up, share it, and if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. It would be really cool to get to 100 subscribers by November. It'll be a year in November that I've been doing um, Let's Play The Sims and... Um, I'm getting distracted because I think my son is up from his nap again, so I better go. <laughs> Alright, thank you for watching.